people mad. You know, they, they say us people people were not for talking for for five minutes. An yes. hour in the seminar. I'll be to <laughs> I beg I'll, I'll, I'll not do that to you guys. Yeah. But I just wanted to say thanks to you to every single person in the room currently right now. Because I did this purposefully because every single person that's been in here Sorry, has inspired me to, you know, translate your energies through the uh, language of music. You know, so one thing I would say is that honestly, I'm fully indebted to every single person in this room. I love you guys. Thank you so much for supporting me. Love you too. Amen. Love. But um, a lot of people in this room as well would know that I have a genuine story. You know, and that's the one thing that um, I'm grateful for having. You know, when I started doing music, it was just to be honest, a secondary thing. Because, you know, Yo, this place is dope. This, this, this bathroom looking clean. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. You know, the stuff with Marvel Squad, one of the best jerking crews in the city at the time. <laughs> and also, when he was talking to me music, that's when I was like, you know what, man? Let me try to pick up something. Let me, let me, let me try to make some beats so we can get on there. You see? And I'm, 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 I'm grateful for you because, again, you've never staggered my growth. And I can say, the people in this room, thank you because you've never staggered my growth. Mm. Because it's very important to have people around you, no matter what happens, any circumstances. And going back to what this, this project means to me, waves, it's never the, the, the same frequency. It has to change. And that's the same thing with relationships. It doesn't matter how hard or how easy it is. It is essential. You see, so again, for you, you have Establish that for me. I am grateful. Thank you. Man, I'm grateful to you, man. Bros, my baby, is up there. Say I'm loud. Say I'm loud. Is up there. Give a round of applause for her. I love you, man. I'm messy. Because. Oh, yeah. Easy, quasi confused. No, no, no. You know, I just want to say through this journey of, you know, regenerating what we're doing with Ozone now, um, that I have somebody at my corner, in my corner that has been there and is able to see how serious I'm taking this and has been transparent with me through that journey. Again, I thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming here. Yeah. And also, I have to say big thank you to my crew, Ozone Creation. Yeah.
Oh three, oh three. Yeah. Let's sing. You see, this this conceptualization came from a place of wanting to do for others. Wanting to do for others. And I'm happy to see what has come and where we are now. Because without a set of a pin of doubt, I know that the stars is not even our limit. <laughs> At all. At all. So I want to say for everybody that has been on the journey with me and for Ozone Creations, thank you so much for being there. I love working with you guys, and thank you for supporting me, putting this together. You know, like there's something that people say is, oh, you're open, it's not easy. You know, it takes a village to raise a child. You know, it doesn't take a child to raise a child. You see, to be a teacher, you have to be a learner. And I learn from these people every single week when we talk about different uh, you know, tasks we have to do, different things we have to fix, little reasons we have to try. So again, yeah, thank you guys. Yeah, shout out to all and um, again, Fuck without you, uh, further ado, this project waves. I want it to be the mark of a genesis when it comes to my creativity. Mm. At least when it comes to when you say, and again, Brother Matt Berry, that was so. Because we had this conversation earlier today on Clubhouse. Mm -hmm. I was um, given an opportunity to be interviewed by Barry. And we talked about, you know, everything in retrospect. Because you asked me, okay, what do you want to teach these kids? The little ones that might not be here. Those children, little boys and little girls that are part of the African diaspora. What do you want to teach them? Is that your culture and your heritage is enough? You do not need to reach out further to higher heights to, to go and get what you think is something that is, is tangible. No. Listen to what your mother and father told you. Listen to those loved ones that come before you, what they told you, and go from there. That's the stuff we need to be listening to. If anything, I'm only but a vessel for that message to come before. Yo. This is this is actually dope, man. An extended play by Obi Original.